Introduction will be that we are actually students from Singapore Polytechnic. Uh, we are in our year three now. We are from Diploma in Business Administration, specializing in entrepreneurship. So, the background from uh, about our course is that basically, um, in entrepreneurship, we just have to run a company, and we are car registered for now. So, for now, we are just trying to pitch our ideas to a lot of people so that they can come on board. So, um. So the team comprises of four, but for now there's only two of us. And then so basically the problem that we want to introduce is that uh, we aim to target the SME and startup as well as the non-full-timers. Non-full-timers here refers to the freelancers and part-timers. The problems that we feel that SME and startup face is that they have the lack of manpower resources to do temporary project-based and ad hoc jobs. <coughs> they also require jobs to be done quick but not full uh, but not utilizing full timers as they are mostly costly. For the non-full timers, they have the lack of connection and client base as well as they do not want to commit to full-time jobs due to the <coughs> due to their commitment. That's why they prefer to do part-time job as well as freelancing. Therefore the solution that we propose is a job hitch. Uh, is to have job hitch. So what exactly is job hitch? Job hitch is a website or app solution that connects both SME and startup to non full timers on ad hoc basis or project basis. So what job hitch does is that it um, users or SMEs or startup can post a job. After that, the non full timers, which refers to the freelancers, can then apply for the job. Afterwards, once the job is being done, this can improve the portfolio of the freelancer. So what are the features of Job Hitch? Firstly, there will be trending jobs where non full timers can find popular jobs and recent jobs around them easily. SMEs can compare freelancers easily where uh, there will be um, where they can compare potential freelancers' skill set and portfolio and select which freelancing they want to work with. And lastly, it advocates non-discrimination as Job Hitch will have a filter that allows the older generation as well as encouraging companies to hire even the older workers as there's an um, increase in number of uh, older workers getting retrenched. Next, I'll be passing my time to my friend who will be talking about the benefits. Okay, so uh, the benefits of job hitch is that we will be, we'll be able to save costs by hiring freelancers on a part-time or ad hoc basis. You will be able to cut down contract workers, which means your SMEs will be able to outsource them at, uh, workers at a lower cost. Secondly, this provides a much efficient way where SMEs can outsource for manpower quickly at their fingertips. And thirdly, it provides a more flexible um, time for SMEs to outsource these workers as SMEs will outsource them at a project basis. And lastly, um, the freelancers will be able to build their portfolios as this platform gives them, as this job which gives them the platform for as for the freelancers to also perform tasks, especially those that do not have contacts to access to um, clients to do their project. So our target customers, as said previously, are SMEs, which are ninety nine percent of the companies in Singapore currently. And based on this data, it showed that. Um, more and more um, companies are moving from uh, are, are providing more unplanned and um, ad hoc arrangements into their companies. Yeah, so at the starting phase, we plan to target freelancers ranging from young adults, ranging from age 15 to 29 years old. And based on this current trend, the students, especially in uni, poly, and IT, are also adopting. Um, freelancing or part-time jobs as their main purpose is also to earn extra income. And also we found out that out of 14 percent of out of 86 percent of the young adults, 70 percent are also willing to take ad hoc part-time jobs. And also this also show an upward trend that students are also more adopting to ad hoc job arrangements. And also, um, now I'll be showing you the prototype of Job Hitch, where um, currently it's in the development phase that will be launched in, they will soft launch at around next May, um, next month.
Okay, so from here, the freelancers will be able to see their trending jobs that they will be able to take out to they, they will be able to take up the recommended jobs and also can browse through by categories. So from here, let's say um you need to you want to help Tom to do a logo design. So from here you'll be able to see a job description and the skills needed. Hence I I feel confident I want to help I want to apply for this job immediately. So from here I'll be able to state the availability that um um that Tom needs. So for the rate, the calendar is highlighted in red, uh, the availability that Tom wants to get the job done. Hence I can highlight the availability that um, are available to do the job. And from there, after confirming, a fixed request will be sent out to Tom where I'll be able to make an offer to do the to do this job for ten dollars. So from here after chatting with Tom, we just only three simple steps. An escrow payment will be made and that Tom will be able to fulfill his need in hiring a logo designer and the ten dollars will be put on escrow where after the job has been completed, I'll be able to receive the payment from Tom after designing a logo. And one of the main features of job reach is that as a job poster, let's say I need someone um to a tuition teacher to teach my primary five son. So from here, I'll be able to see the freelancers for hire, their skills, and their description. From here, I also will be able to see the profile here, where I'll be able to see the jobs completed on this platform, and also the reviews, past project experience, and their qualifications as well. And one good thing about this platform is that you'll be able to compare the potential freelancers, and from there, if they, if based on your requirement, if they match around let's say ninety percent of the required um jobs, the requirements that you need for the job, there will be a best suit here where you'll be able to see the freelancers that is best suited for a job. And also, if they like a job post, this also provides a good platform for um job posters to also start prospecting for potential freelancers. So from here, you also will be able to compare the the um, characteristics of those freelancers and their skills that they have. So these are our three main competitors. Where Fast Job mainly provides part time jobs. Fiverr mainly um, has a huge source of freelancers and also job street. So how could can we compare to these competitors? From here, Jobish aims to be one of the most flexible platforms where instead of job street and fast jobs, Jobish also um, focuses on ad hoc job arrangements. And also for now, we also plan to be more affordable than Fiverr as Fiverr takes a 20% commission from um, freelancers from their pay which, which can add a huge sum for the freelancers in the long run. And also for SMEs, they will be able to also enjoy unlimited job postings at only $25 a month. So as said earlier, our main competitive advantage is affordability and convenience made easy for SMEs. These are our three main revenue streams where there will be advertisements on the platform, job posting and subscription and also the boost feature where SMEs will be able to pay a fixed sum in order to push their job request into, um, to make it more visible. Okay, so these are our, at only $25 a month, SMEs will be able to enjoy unlimited job posting and also will be able to um, have the full benefits of this platform. So for now, you can contact us because um, for now we are doing market validation stage where we have contacts for web developers and also um, people doing events or photography. So now if you need these um, people to help you to uh, perform your tasks. We do have this um, people already, this manpower already in place. So if you have any questions or inquiries, do feel free to contact us. Also follow Jobish SG at um, Instagram. Okay, thank you.